The thing a parent wants is for their child to be happy and to be capable and to be a good person. I have nine children and Mark is the ninth. Mark's a typical 14 and a half year old boy. He's very strong. It was clear by the time he was 16 to 18 months that something wasn't right. We actually told the pediatrician we think he has muscular dystrophy. And I was so hoping to have been wrong. A Duchenne child is like an ice sculpture of your boy. And what happens with Duchenne is your boy's melting. It doesn't have to be that way. I started printing out papers on Duchenne uh, research, and I see this Dr. Duan. He has so much enthusiasm for finding a solution for Duchenne muscular dystrophy. If my son have the disease, what I'm going to do? You want to stop it. You want them to enjoy the life. Now, I think that's important for, I mean, me and my lab members. There's always a solution for a problem. How can we do better? What is the problem facing the field right now? And how can we improve it? 15 years ago, people would have said, there's no way you would be able to have gene therapy in a child with Duchenne in under 25 or 30 years. And now we, we see that that's not the case. It's not s sort of blind hope. This, this is based on real science, real progress. And we have to aim higher than we've ever aimed. We have to dream bigger than we've ever dreamed. And we have to work together more as a team if we really want to make the difference that we all want to make. I think this place will change the world by bringing all of the resources of the UM system together. We have an unparalleled opportunity for us to lead the way in true innovation. This new facility is going to provide an interactive environment that brings together the researchers that build the basic pieces of drugs, researchers that test these drugs in living bodies, and researchers that translate these drugs into the clinic in one space. The whole point of it is to help more people faster. At the end of the day, that's really what makes this whole precision medicine initiative just fantastic. It's what will change the outcome for so many people.